First up tonight is Mr. Jude Bonner, son of Wesley and Dina Bonner, escorted by the mother and brother, Julian Bonner. He has played varsity football the last two years and plans to continue his education and major in business management. Mr. Nathan Carter is escorted by his mother, Sonia Kraft, and grandmother, Teresa Kraft. Nathan has been in the band for five years and just started football this year. Nathan plans to attend TVCC, enlist in the Navy, and then finish a degree in architecture. Mr. James East is escorted by his mother, Selena Mitchell, and father James East, and grandmother, Janice East. He has played varsity football all four years and plans to go to the Universal Technical Institute in Dallas. Mr. Juan Garcia is escorted by his parents, Jesus and Esther, Esther Garcia. He has played football for two years and plans to become a doctor. Mr. Clay Hinkle is escorted by his grandfather, John Cage, his mother, Susan, Susan Hinkle, and his father, Rodney Hinkle. He has been on the varsity football team for two years and has enlisted in the U.S. Army. Mr. J.J. Hughes is escorted by his father, Jason Tracy. J.J. has been on the varsity three years and made the Henderson County Dream Team this year and plans to put a uh, Tyler Junior College for Wellman. Mr. Dylan Hunsacker is escorted by his parents, Cheryl and Michael Hunsacker. He has played th three years of varsity football and plans to attend trade school. Mr. Mikey Marshall is escorted by his mother, Shauna Nevels, his stepfather, Randall Nevels, and his father, Nathan Ross. He has been on the varsity football team for three years and is undecided about future plans. Mr. Terry Richardson is escorted by his father, Terry Richardson. Terry has played football the last three years and plans on joining the U.S. Navy and then becoming a police officer. Mr. Xavier Robertson is escorted by his parents, Wendy and Jeff Graham, and his sister, Angela Graham. He has played football the last two years and plans to get a degree in computer science and pursue a career as a computer software engineer. Mr. Cameron Rogers is escorted tonight by his parents, Troy and Michelle Rogers, and his brother, Lance Rogers. He has played varsity football three years and plans to attend college and get a job after high school. Mr. Stone Watchworth is escorted by his mother, Jan Watchworth. He has played defensive back on the varsity for the last two years and plans to run track in college, move to New York, and work as a real work in the real estate business. Mr. Dylan Wisdom is escorted by his parents, Deanna Maples and Dennis Wisdom, and his stepfather, Stephen Hardy. He has played varsity football the last two years and plans to attend Universal Technical Institute. Miss Michaela Wolverton is escorted by her mother, Otto Mitchell, brother Addison Snell, and sister Christina Snell. She was in band for two years and has been a trainer for three years. Michaela plans to get her uh, to get her registered nurse degree after high school. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, let's give the football players and trainers just another round of uh, applause, please. I want to introduce our band members. Miss Tommy Bain is escorted tonight by her parents, Misty and Joe Bain. She has been a member of the high school band for five years and plans to attend Baylor University to become a doctor. Miss Christine Holler is escorted by her parents, Ronnie and Sky Gold. She has been in band all four years and attend, plans to attend TVCC for a nursing degree. Christine wants to go on to become a pediatric oncologist nurse. 
Mr. Colin Hoffman is escorted by his parents, Mandy and Patrick Hoffman. He has been in band all four years. Colin plans to attend TVCC and then transfer to a four-year university to major in freight industry. Mr. Justin Legal is escorted by his parents, Frank and Don Lowe. He has been in band throughout high school and is planning on majoring in music with a minor in education at Stephen F. Austin University. Ms. Hazel Watley is escorted by her parents, Susan and Richard Cox. Hazel has enlisted in the Army and plans to work in radio communications. Ms. Shelby White is escorted by her parents, Floyd and Michelle White. She has been in band and has run cross country all four years. She is a cross country team captain this year and plans to attend Baylor University to pursue a psychology degree. Now presenting our cheerleaders. Miss Peyton Swartz is escorted tonight by her parents, Sam and Tammy Swartz. She has been a varsity cheerleader all four years. Peyton plans to attend Texas A&M University and get a degree in civil engineering. Miss Lane Scott is escorted by her mother and stepfather, Dale and David Dialva. She has been on the cheer squad all four years. Lane plans to attend junior college, then transfer to Tarleton State to study equine science. Now presenting our cross country. Mr. Zane Arambula is escorted by Nancy Doherty and Emily Arambula, excuse me. He has been in cross country all four years. Zane plans to get a degree from Texas Tech, join the Air Force, and become a pilot. <laughs> Miss Sky Burns is escorted by Donnie and Shauna Burns. She was in band three years and cross country all four years. Sky plans to attend Texas A&M, become a veteran, veterinarian, and eventually have her own animal rescue organization. Mr. Erickson Good Johnson is escorted by his parents Karen and Eric Good Johnson. Erickson has run cross country the last three years. Erickson plans to enroll in pre med at the University of Texas in Austin and become a doctor. Ms. Kara Henson is escorted by her parents Tammy and David Henson. She has been in cross country throughout high school. Kara plans to get a degree in business after she completes high school. Mr. Matthew Melton is escorted by his mother, Teresa Melton. Matthew has participated in band and cross country for three years. He plans to attend the Air Force Academy to become a pilot after high school. Miss Molly McAtee is escorted by her parents, Steve and Sarah McAtee. She has been on the cheer squad all four years and run cross country the last three years. Molly wants to pursue a degree in early childhood education after high school. Mr. Andrew Page is escorted by his parents, Cindy Lewis and Darren Page. He has been on the cross country team throughout high school. Andrew plans to attend Laterno University serve in the Air Force, fly fighter jets, and then become a commercial pilot. Mr. Gabriel Purcelli is escorted by his mother, Sherry Purcelli, and his cousin, Haley Purcelli. He has run varsity cross country all four years, flag runner for the last three years, and he joined the cheer squad this year. Gabe plans to, to attend Laterno University to major in mechanical engineering and then join the Air Force. 
Miss Brianna Reagan is escorted by her mother, Renee Scott. Renee has been on the cross country team throughout high school. She plans to attend TVCC and then transfer to UT Tyler. Mr. Aiden Reed is escorted by his mother, Kumi Taylor. His freshman and sophomore year, he was part of the state bronze medal team and was among the top five runners on this year's team. Aiden plans to run for the Lerntorno University and study kinesiology on his way to becoming a cross country coach. Miss Alyssa Shaddox is escorted by her parents, Elizabeth and Steve Shaddox. Aliz, Aliz, I'm sorry, Alyssa plans to attend TBCC, then further her education to become a radiologist. Miss J.C. Warner is escorted by her grandfather, John Cage. She has been on the cross country team all four years and plans to attend UT Tyler to major in nursing. Ms. Chanda Westbrook is escorted by her grandfather, Bill Westbrook, Uncle Michael Westbrook, and her nephew, Andrew Westbrook. She has been on the cross-country team for all four years in high school. Mr. Michael Wong is escorted by his mother, Jamie Evans. He has been on the cross-country team all four years. After high school, Michael plans to join the U.S. Army. Finally tonight, and joining us is Krista Bragg and Mandy England in honor of Heath Bragg. Heath participated in band and football. He brought a smile to people's faces, touched the hearts of many, and forever changed the class of 2017. His greatest gift was love, and he will ever be a bulldog. Please help us thank and congratulate our class of 2017 seniors by giving them a big round of applause. Thank you, and enjoy tonight's game.